In the tech world, where every company thinks they re ahead of the curve and every new gadget claims to be a revolution, nobody expected the ground to shake this hard, this suddenly, and from a direction almost nobody was looking at. Because while Meta spent years polishing the Ray-Ban smart glasses into a trendy little wearable for influencers and casual users, a completely different brand just showed up and pulverized everything the industry thought it understood about smart eyewear, flipping the entire category upside down with a pair of glasses that don't just take pictures. Don't T just play music, Don T just respond to voice commands, but actually behave like a full-blown computer strapped effortlessly onto your face, and the craziest part is how shockingly polished and powerful they are straight out of the box making competitors look like toys from a different era. For years, Meta's Ray-Ban glasses held the crown simply because there was nobody else swinging with real strength. Their lightweight frames, stylish design, and decent voice recognition made them the go-to choice for people who wanted something subtle. But let us be brutally honest, as much as they were fun, they were nothing close to actual computing devices and couldn't. T realistically replace your phone, your screen, your apps, or even basic productivity tools, which is why what just happened with Inmo's newest release is so shocking. The Inmo Air 3 didn't T come from Silicon Valley royalty like Meta, Apple, or Google, nor from the usual AR hopefuls who overpromise and underdeliver. Instead, this thing arrived quietly and detonated the entire market by packing a full Android system, a proper processor, and dual. High resolution displays into a pair of glasses that somehow look simple, feel surprisingly comfortable and operate like a private wearable workstation. Unlike Meta S Tiny 600-600 LCD, that struggles against sunlight and can T do anything beyond minimal tasks, the Air 3 hides dual 1080p Sony old panels behind each lens, firing crisp, vibrant visuals through high-end waveguide optics that make everything you watch feel like you're re-staring at a floating 100-inch. IMAX style screen only you can see and because the projection is internal, secure, and completely isolated. Nobody beside you has even the slightest chance of glancing at your content, meaning you can watch. Movies, edit documents, or browse sensitive material on a plane in a cafe or in a crowded lobby without worrying about privacy. But the killer feature isn't the screen, it's the brain behind it. Because instead of acting like an accessory, the Air 3 literally is a phone, a tablet, and a micro laptop disguised as eyewear running full Android 14 with an 8-core chipset, smooth RAM allocation, and full Play Store support. Oh, meaning you're not just getting notifications. You're installing real apps, running YouTube, opening Gmail, managing Google Docs, editing slides, taking calls, scrolling socials, multitasking across Windows, and even wirelessly mirroring your actual laptop into a private floating workspace, a feature so unbelievably futuristic, it feels like something stolen straight from a sci-fi film. And here's where things get wild and moded and T simply attach a camera to the side like the Ray-Bans do where everything looks slightly off-center or tilted. They position their camera directly between the user, eyes capturing footage that perfectly matches your natural viewpoint, giving you clean, accurate POV recordings without the awkward distortions other glasses struggle with. But the biggest surprise is how you control the whole system, because Inmo didn't T settle for just voice commands or touch gestures. They built a full suite of control options, including responsive touch strips, a motion tracking smart ring that follows your finger, movements in 3D space, and a tiny remote style touchpad ideal for long work sessions. Plus they redeveloping a muscle sensing wristband that reads micro movements and translates them into commands instantly, basically giving you access to a future where your smallest gestures trigger digital actions. Battery life is expected ISNT all day, because powering dual, old screens, a real operating system, Wi-Fi GPS, and a Snapdragon. Oh. Chipset inside something as small as a pair of glasses is no joke, but most users can squeeze a couple of solid hours of heavy use and because it fast charges to more than half in around 30 minutes, it's far more practical than early prototypes we saw years ago. The weight while higher than Meta S Ray-Bans is distributed intelligently across the frame, meaning once you adjust them. They sit comfortably without pressing too much on your nose or ears, which is impressive considering the amount of hardware stuffed inside. The connectivity suite alone makes these glasses feel more like a miniature workstation than wearable tech with Wi-Fi 6. Bluetooth 5.3 built-in. 
GPS and enough storage to carry your essential apps files and offline content turning the Air 3 into a device that can. Replace your tablet on trips your laptop in tight spaces and your phone screen when privacy matters. But the moment you slip the glasses on and navigate through the Air 3's interface that S when it finally hits you, this is what smart glasses should have always been, because instead of giving you small, floating widgets, or simple notifications like older wearables, the system opens full windows you can move resize and place anywhere in your field of view. Imagine dragging YouTube to the upper right, dropping your email to the left, leaving a document hovering front and center, and then swiveling your head while every window stays locked in your world exactly where you placed it, like you re-inside your own personal operating room. Add a Bluetooth keyboard and mouse, and suddenly you, reworking in a full desktop-like environment with zero physical monitor in front of you, which is the moment people realize this ISN. T a gimmick. This is a computer that just happens to sit on your face. The laptop mirroring mode is a game changer on its own. Picture yourself on a plane with everyone hunched over small dim screens while you, you're sitting back watching a cinematic display floating like a digital theater in your sight, completely invisible to anyone. Around you, with no glare, no light leakage, and no privacy concerns whatsoever, which instantly transforms travel productivity and entertainment. Even audio, while not aiming to replace high-end earbuds, focuses on clear, directional sound that keeps your content mostly private without echoing across the room or disturbing people nearby. But all these features bring us to the single most shocking part, the value. You'd expect glasses that can replace your phone project, massive virtual screens run desktop-style multitasking support full. Android process 3D gestures and offer professional-grade POV capture to cost well over $1,000, maybe even more given how early we are in this tech cycle, but Inmo launched the Air 3 at a price only slightly above Meta's newest Ray-Ban model, meaning for roughly $100 more. You re not just getting an upgrade, you're re-stepping into an entirely different category of hardware. Ray-Bans are fun, stylish, and great for creators, but the Air 3 behaves like a compact computer, a virtual movie theater, a POV camera, a work hub, and a private. Productivity suite all merged into one device, and that shift changes everything. Sure, there are drawbacks. Bright sunlight can wash out some contrast. Early adopters will need time to adjust to a computer resting on their face. And battery management requires occasional awareness. But compared to every other attempt from giants like Google Glass, Rokid, Vuzix, and even early meta prototypes, the Air 3 is the first pair that actually feels ready for normal consumers. For real work, real entertainment, real travel, and real everyday use. And that puts enormous pressure on the tech giants because once users experience glasses that can stream full films, run entire apps. Mirror computers manage workloads and deliver massive private. Screens expectations will never go back to the era of lightweight notification toys. We are stepping across a line in the history of wearable tech, from cute accessory to actual machine, from helpful tool to full computer. This is the moment smart glasses evolve or die. And when you realize this is just the beginning, that future models will be lighter, sharper, faster, more immersive, and more powerful, you begin to see where we. Reheading a world where your next computer ISNT in your pocket, your backpack, or your desk, it's on your face, replacing screens forever, turning the space around you into the interface itself. And if the Inmo Air 3 is what the first real wave looks like, the next generation is going to completely redefine what we think technology can be. So if this opened your eyes even a little, smash that like button, drop your thoughts in the comments. Tell me whether you ditch your laptop for glasses like these. Make sure to subscribe, because the next video takes this technology to an even more insane level. You re-not ready for what's coming next.